Hey guys, so today I thought I'd do a video all about me. Um, I just came across this about me tag um, and I thought it would be quite useful for you guys to get to know me a little bit better. Um, I know we did the boyfriend tag as sort of that as a couple thing um, to get us know, to know us better but seeing as I do most of the videos obviously um, I thought it would be better for you guys to know a bit more about me. Yes, I do. My middle name is Emily. I left school seven years ago because uh, obviously over in the UK we go to 16 at school and then we go to college um, till we're 18. So yeah, <laughs> I did both by the way. Um, but yeah, at school my favourite subject was probably art or child development. I've always been a very creative person and I've always wanted to work with children and have my own kids so yeah sort of just shows and the things that I most enjoy to be honest. I don't really know, um, probably just water. <laughs> to be fair like if I go out for a meal I'll either have water or I'll have some sort of fruit drink, um, J2O or like I'm not a huge, like I like some fizzy drinks but I don't have them that often anymore at all. Um, and it's like, even when I do special occasions, it's like schler and stuff like that. But I wouldn't say they're my favourite drink, so I don't know. I'd probably have to go with a photograph by Ed Sheeran. Love Ed Sheeran, like, who doesn't love Ed Sheeran? I mean, hello. Um, but like, I just really like that song. I, I love all his songs, to be honest, but it's just the one that's been playing in my mind a lot recently. I've already done a video about this, so go check that out. Um, but, I don't know, at, at the moment, if I was to have a boy, I'd probably name him Ezra. If I was to have a girl, I'd probably name her Ariana. Next, obviously, because I've already got my Isla. <laughs> Not anymore. Um, I used to, I used to be fairly sporty, um, well, say sporty. Um, I used to do gymnastics, um, and it was more just like participating in some school things like netball and basketball and stuff like that. Um, I was never really part of a team for a long period of time. Dance, I did do dancing for a while. Um, but as I got older, I just fell away from a lot of that stuff. I do really wish I hadn't because I really still enjoy dancing and gymnastics, not that I'm any good at it anymore, but I really wish I'd kept it up. But I don't know, I had been looking into possibly doing some adult dance classes, which is fun. <laughs> um, I just feel like a noob and, you know, a bit silly starting again as an adult, but you've got to start somewhere for things that you enjoy, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe do some dancing soon. If you didn't know already, I am a bookworm. I love books. I love reading. Um, but saying that, I don't honestly know if I have a favourite. My tastes change all the time. Like, I like have read all the like the Twilight books, and I've read all the Mockingjay and Divergent series, and um, what else? Um, on, let me look at my oh yeah, like City of Bones and stuff, and like Nicholas Sparks books. Like literally, my taste varies from. Typically romance has to be sort of an element, but I do like a little bit of action, but then I like period drama ones as well, so uh, I don't know if I have a favourite, I just, I change all the time, but that's an idea of the type of books that I do like. I like pastel colours, but my favourite colour would have to be like a turquoisey teal, but more of a pastel version of it, like my, my like the colour of my bedroom. Um, I don't know if I have a favourite animal. When I was younger, I was obsessed with dolphins, like obsessed, like my whole bedroom was dolphins. Now, I don't really know. I love animals. I'm an animal lover. Yeah, I'd probably say dogs, wolves, and monkeys are sort of my top. Like, I love monkeys, they're just so cute. Um, I really want a finger monkey, I wanna own one. Penguins, yes. Liam, Liam's favourite animal is definitely penguins. I love Ghost as a brand really. I tend to go between their ones. Um, I've had quite a few. I think at the moment the one I've got is Cherish. Um, and I like Sweetheart one, I think. 
not very good at the names, and they're, is it the Dark Knight one? The one shaped like a moon. Um, yeah, I've got that one as well. I love, I love their ones. I watched a few different videos of doing this tag, and people answered this differently. A lot of people answered it as if it, holidays as in, um, like, Christmas or um, Valentine's or Halloween, and other people said, like, going abroad but then there's another question later on have you been abroad so I'm gonna answer it as if my favorite holiday like American term because every here we call our holidays going away so <laughs> um, but yeah my favorite holiday in that way is Christmas by far um, a lot of people say Halloween which I was really shocked at um, but now I Christmas is by far my favorite um, for numerous reasons but I love the whole magic of it and being able to like, especially now having Isla, like, I'm so excited as she gets older to be able to create that magical feeling for her and, you know, it's just so special and I love giving gifts, like, I, it's, that's more exciting for me is going out and buying lots of different people specific gifts for them and seeing their faces and, yeah, it's just, oh, love it. Yes, only three times though, like when I'm not like a world travel person <laughs> and growing up we didn't exactly have a huge amount of money with being just my mum so like the opportunities weren't as widely things but we went like camping and <laughs> stuff a lot um, inside of the UK obviously but I do, I have been to Cyprus, Malta and New York, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really wish I did. I did try learning Spanish a couple of years ago um, because I love, like, I think out of all the languages that sort of appeal to me, I think Spanish just does. I don't know what it is, but it's sort of sexy and um, just really beautiful. I think just the words and that just sound, it sounds really nice. Um, and yeah, I started learning some things, so I know a few words of that, but not nothing major, nothing to hold a conversation with at all. Um, obviously, I know a little bit of like French and um, German, which we learn at school. Um, we only I only did it for like a year or two or something like that. I don't know. I have I have two I have two older sisters. Um, one's five years older than me, and one's seven years older than me. I'm the baby. Is this like fashion? <laughs> I don't know. Um, see, I'm not like, I like clothes obviously, and I like fashion stuff, but I'm actually much more into homeware and things like that. So I'd probably have to say that my favorite store, at least one of my favorite store is Next, because I love absolutely to die for, I love their homeware. It's expensive, but I love it with fashion and, yeah, um, and I love their baby clothes as well for Isla, they're amazing. I'm not as keen on the adult clothes, I think they're a bit mumsy sometimes and a bit granny style. Um, I tend to shop at like New Look and Primark just because it's cheap. Um, ASOS online, um, Massalan sometimes, honestly I shop about and just pick different things from here and there all the time and mix and match and just come up with my own sort of style and whatever I like really. Um, so I wouldn't say I have a store that I go to for fashion wise all the time, it changes so, um, but in terms of like homeware and for Isla, next by far, I love it. Uh, I don't know, we don't really go out to a lot of restaurants really, um, but I think I'd have to say Harvester is the one that we go to the most frequently and I do like it because it's quite easy and cheapish. Um, there, the other one, we sort of have a brand over here of Weatherspoons, um, that's alright. We go to a, quite a few like pub restaurants and they're not like chain restaurants, so they're just individual little places around here. And some of them are quite nice, but honestly I don't know if I really have a favourite. Uh, not so much really. It was alright. I knew I had to get through it and I got through it and that was it, really. <laughs> um, it was a tough tough time for me. Typically, as a lot of people do, I went through quite a bit of bullying and people picking on me for being skinny and spotty and yeah, just the typical stupid things that people do. 
um, especially girls being nice and bitchy. Overall, like, I don't completely regret it. I have some good memories from it. It is what it is, basically. <laughs> Oh, where do I start? There's so many. Um, probably have to go for the Sacconi Jellies. I have loved them for so long. <laughs> like, oh, I so really badly, badly want to meet them. Um, typically, Zoella and Louise and Happy Days and Joe and all of them lot, all of the, pretty much most of the UK ones, <laughs> not having against anyone else. It's just, I think it's partly because out of all of them, I'm probably more likely to meet them. <laughs> One day, maybe. Um, but no, there is so many YouTubers out there that I love. Again, I don't think I have a favourite movie. I'm a movie lover. I love lots and lots of movies. I think my closest one would probably have to be The Notebook. I guess it was one of my first sort of, you know, typical romance ones that I just love and I've watched over and over and over again and it still, every time, still gets me. Um, I do obviously love all the Nicholas Sparks films and books and quite a lot of other typical chick flicks but despite all of that, my other favourite films, like I'm not just girly girl, <laughs> I love Fast and Furious, love them, um, Underworld, love that, um, obviously a Divergent series, Hunger Games, yeah, just, there's loads, there's loads of films and books and things that I just love them all. Again, <laughs> there's so many that I like. At the moment we're watching Prison Break and I'm enjoying that. I wouldn't say it's my favourite but I do really enjoy it. Um, Walking Dead is one of our favourites, it's definitely Liam's probably more than mine. I love Pretty Little Liars, Heart of Dixie, um, Nashville, I love Nashville. Nashville's one of my favourites as well. Um, Switched at Birth, I love Switched at Birth. Um. <laughs> PC. Um, I haven't really, I've never had a Mac, so I can't really say that I'm that thing on them. I have played on a few, a couple of times. Um, when I was at college, I did film studies and we made a little film and I edited, edited it on a Mac. And editing software, is really nice on a Mac, I have to say, but as a whole system, it takes me a while to get used to it, so for now, PC. <laughs> I have a iPhone 5S. <laughs> Has my fingerprints. I love it. I am 5 foot 1. I'm tiny. <laughs> I'm really small. Not great in a crowd, but I can hide, so, you know. If I need to run away from someone and hide, I'm alright. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, so I think that is all the questions. Um, I would love to answer any of your questions, if any of you do have any questions. So please feel free to put anything in the comments and stuff. And I'll try and do some maybe FAQs.